UN officials say that the humanitarian crisis on the ground worsened in recent weeks as Israel advanced into Rafah, forcing thousands to evacuate and flood into nearby camps. The advance closing vital border crossings and creating unsafe conditions for aid groups to operate. At the new peer project launched by the United States last week, reports of looting adding more strain, but the U.S. says that food is still getting in. The International Criminal Court accuses Israel of using starvation as a method of warfare, a claim that Israel denies. There is no starvation in Gaza. There is the narrative of starvation pushed by Israel's enemies that continues to incentivize Hamas's ongoing attempts to steal food from the population. The U.N. says conditions on the ground could get even worse since volunteers can no longer distribute food aid in Rafah because of a lack of supplies and ongoing security concerns.